You know that sinking feeling when the month ends and despite your best budgeting efforts, you're still scraping the bottom of the barrel? Yeah, we've all been there. It's like being on a financial roller coaster and you're just hanging on for dear life. But what if I told you there's a way to stop that stomach-churning ride and put yourself back in the driver's seat? Welcome to the world of zero-based budgeting. If you're scratching your head and thinking, zero what now? Don't worry, we're here to break it down for you. Zero-based budgeting, or ZBB for short, is a budgeting method where your income minus your expenses equals zero. No, we're not talking about spending all your money, we're talking about giving every dollar a purpose. Think of it like this. You're the boss and your dollars are your employees. With ZBB, you're giving each dollar a specific job to do. Whether it's paying the rent, buying groceries, or saving for that dream vacation, every single dollar has a role to play. Now you might be thinking, that sounds like a lot of work, but the benefits of zero-based budgeting are worth it. First off, it gives you a clear picture of where your money is going. No more wondering where that last $20 disappeared to. Secondly, it puts you in control of your spending. You decide where your money goes instead of being at the mercy of impulse buys or unexpected expenses. And finally, it helps you achieve your savings goals. Whether you're saving for a rainy day, retirement, or that shiny new gadget, ZBB can help you get there faster. So, if you're tired of that end-of-the-month scramble or feeling like your finances are out of control, it's time to give zero-based budgeting a try. We're about to dive into a game-changing budgeting strategy. It's like getting a financial GPS that guides you to your goals. So buckle up, because we're about to take a crash course in financial freedom. If you're tired of this financial roller coaster, stick around. We're about to dive into a game-changing budgeting strategy. Ever heard of the zero-based budgeting approach? It's like the rebellious cousin of traditional budgeting. Now before we dive into the nitty-gritty of this rebellious cousin, let's first meet the docile one, traditional budgeting. This approach is all about history. It's like a rearview mirror, guiding your future spending based on your past. You have a budget, you stick to it, and changes are based on last year's numbers. It's familiar, it's comfortable, but it's not always the most effective. Enter zero-based budgeting, the approach that dares to ask, what if we started from scratch every month? It's like a clean slate with every sunrise or, well, every first day of month. You assign every dollar a job, whether it's for rent, groceries, or that upcoming nothing is left to chance or impulse, it's all part of the plan. Now you might be thinking, that sounds like a lot of work. A common is that zero-based budgeting is time-consuming, but like learning to ride a bike or the perfect omelet, it gets easier with practice. You'll soon find it's not about spending more time, but about spending your time more wisely. Another myth is that zero-based budgeting is rigid. Well, let me tell you, it's as flexible as a gymnast. Your budget is not set in stone, but a living, breathing entity that changes as your needs do. Got an unexpected windfall? Great, assign those dollars a job. Had an unexpected expense? No problem, adjust your budget accordingly. So, no, zero-based budgeting isn't a time-consuming monster. It's a flexible, adaptable strategy that puts you in the driver's seat of your finances. It's about empowerment, autonomy, and knowing that every dollar you earn has a purpose. Because in world of zero-based budgeting, every dollar is a foot soldier in the army of your financial goals. And who wouldn't want an army at their command? If you found this information helpful, don't forget to hit the like button on this video. Make sure you subscribe to our channel for more financial tips and tricks. Let's keep empowering you to be the master of your finances. Ready to build your zero-based budget? It's as easy as one, two, three. Step one, gather your income. This means every single dollar you earn. Whether it's your 9-to-5 job, your side hustle selling hand-knit scarves, or that birthday check from grandma, it all counts. Step 2 involves identifying your expenses. These can be divided into two categories, fixed and variable. Your fixed expenses are those that stay the same each month, like your rent or mortgage, car payment, and utilities. Then, there are your variable expenses which fluctuate from month to month. These include groceries, dining out, entertainment, and that online shopping habit we all secretly have. But don't forget about those non-monthly expenses, you know, the ones that sneak up on you like a ninja in the night. These might include holiday gifts, vehicle maintenance, or annual subscription fees. By setting aside funds for these each month, you'll avoid those nasty surprise attacks on your budget. Now, on to the third and most important step, assigning every dollar a job. This is where you take control, telling your money exactly where it's going to go. Whether it's towards your rent, your savings goals, or paying off that pesky credit card debt, 
Every dollar has a mission. And here's a little nugget of wisdom. Always prioritize your needs over your wants. Sure, that new pair of shoes might be calling your name, but your rent payment is screaming it. Prioritizing needs over wants doesn't mean you can't have fun, it just means being smart about it. Now, you might be wondering, what if I have money left over? Well, in zero-based budgeting, there's no such thing as left over. If you've covered all your expenses and met your savings goals for the month, assign that extra money a job. Maybe it's paying down debt faster, or maybe it's going towards a special treat for yourself because hey, you've earned it. At the end of the day, zero-based budgeting is about empowerment. It's about taking control of your financial future one dollar at a time. It's not about depriving yourself but rather about making informed decisions that align with your financial goals. So, are you ready to give zero-based budgeting a shot? Remember it's not about perfection but progress. It's not about restriction but liberation. And most importantly it's not about the money, but the freedom that comes with financial control. Remember, in zero-based budgeting, every dollar has a mission. It's about making your money work for you, not the other way around. Now that you've built your budget, how do you make it stick? It's all about tracking, reviewing, and adapting. Let's unravel this. First up, tracking your spending. You've assigned every dollar a job, now you've got to make sure it's punching in on time and doing its work. From your morning latte to your monthly rent, keep track of every penny. You can go old school with pen and paper or make use of budgeting apps and spreadsheets. Whatever floats your financial boat. Tracking isn't just about knowing where your money goes, it's about understanding your habits. Do you find yourself splurging on takeout on Fridays after a long week? Or maybe you're shelling out more than you thought on hobbies. Awareness is the first step to making changes. Next, you've got to review and adapt. Think of your budget as a garden. It needs regular tending, pruning, and sometimes replanting. Review your budget weekly or monthly based on your preference. Look at where you've overspent, underspent, and hit the nail on the head. Did you budget too much for entertainment and not enough for groceries? Adjust for next time. Did you get a raise or lose a source of income? Time to rejig those numbers. The beauty of zero-based budgeting is its flexibility. It's not a rigid framework, but a fluid plan that changes with your life. Now, let's talk about a bonus tip, automating savings. It's like having a personal assistant who takes care of your future self. Set up automatic transfers to your savings account or towards your retirement fund. This ensures you're consistently working towards your savings goals without the fear of forgetting or the temptation of spending that money elsewhere. But what if you slip up? Maybe you splurged on a night out or had an unexpected expense. Don't beat yourself up. Remember, zero-based budgeting isn't about perfection, it's about progress. It's not a failure, but a learning opportunity. Adjust, adapt, and keep moving forward. Zero-based budgeting is like a fitness journey. The first few weeks may be tough, but as you build those budgeting muscles and form habits, it becomes second nature. And just like a fitness journey, everyone's path is unique. What works for one person might not work for another. So don't be afraid to adjust and adapt your budget to fit your lifestyle and goals. Remember, a budget isn't set in stone. It's a living, breathing plan that changes as your life does. So keep tracking, keep adapting, and keep striving towards your financial goals. With zero-based budgeting, you're not just managing your money, you're mastering it. So, there you have it folks. Zero-based budgeting in a nutshell. Let's do a quick recap. First, gather your income sources, from your main job to that side hustle you've been working on. Next, identify your expenses, fixed and variable, and don't forget those non-monthly expenses. Then the crux of zero-based budgeting, assign every dollar a job. Whether it's covering expenses, padding your savings, or paying off debt, every dollar has a purpose. Remember, it's not about restricting your spending but about taking control of it. It's about understanding where your money is going and making conscious decisions about your financial future. Zero-based budgeting is a powerful tool that can help you take control of your finances. It may seem daunting at first but with practice it becomes second nature. So what are you waiting for? Give it a try and see the difference it can make in your financial life. If you found this video helpful, please give it a thumbs up and subscribe to our channel for more financial tips and tricks. Thanks for watching.